Good morning, everybody. It's a bit early, and yeah, see you in a minute when I've woken up. Any day that starts with a supercharge is going to be a good day. Hello. Well, this can't be good. Bumped into you two. <laughs> so we've got extra people today, have we? Yes. In today's activity. Two newbies. Oh yeah. Yeah, Brian. Cool. He's only been an hour on his skateboard, and that's it. <laughs> We're going to go real slow, which actually suits me just down to the ground because uh, I'm at least three or four very strong coffees away from full consciousness. Right, got my rocket fuel. I did forget to unplug. That's just the way today's going so far. Okay. Oops. Okay, I can slowly feel the caffeine waking me up. I love caffeine. You know, Milton Keynes is kind of perfect for Teslas. A bunch of roundabouts separated by national speed limit dual carriageways. Great fun. Hi everyone. You could actually, there's probably another spacing blend to a bit further away. Are you after a photo of Oh, well, well, come on, let's have a photo. We had to move the cars because of the photo opportunity of six Teslas all in a line. Well, I did think there were going to be seven of us. Are we missing someone? Ah! Nice weather for it too. Never regen a full battery. Well, I don't anyway. Whilst I'm doing a bit of exercise, quick public safety announcement. These remotes, the second you put anything on the brake, it disconnects the throttle. So if you're accelerating, and then you touch the brake a little bit, you're going to go forwards and the board is going to stop. Isn't that right, Mark? I have, had, I have read that somewhere. <laughs> yeah. I just tried it out as well, and it is, it is the case. <laughs> and what's more, your camera can be thrown on the floor if it's not zipped up. <laughs> yeah, well, you're lucky the camera wasn't on, otherwise it probably would have yeah, had a problem. I just, just did stopped. it again and it wasn't the brake. Did it? Yep. It just didn't pull the power in and then it did. That's not good. Mark is repairing his board because it, it has had a few little disconnection issues. Definitely not right. Definitely not right. Done it again. Yeah. Did it just do that? Yeah, it came in. Yeah, I think that's a take it back to the shop job. On the other side, you'll get loads of exercise today. It must have a speaker in it or something that they can say, Oi, out of work! <laughs> What's it going to do now? It can't go into the road, surely? You are so mean. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, brilliant. Oh, brilliant. Oh, brilliant. There's another one of those drones things over there. And one that way. I think today's vlog post is going to be about these silly drone things. Autonomous food delivery. There are 
quite cool. I wonder how many food delivery drivers they put out of work though. You'll get self-driving and AI and what it will effectively do is move people away from the more menial jobs and towards the more less menial jobs. You know what I mean. Like vlogging! <laughs> oh, is vlogging a job? Mind you, it's Sunday and I was up till quite late last night editing, so yes, I think it, we're going to call it a job. Right, unfortunately, I'm going to have to turn around in a second, so, dull, but it is Mother's Day and, you know, I need to go and be sociable with my mother rather than just playing with my friends. Okay. Did it again. Did it again. Three times. So he's the board of the remote. Three times. Probably the remote, isn't it? Done a solid six miles as you can see the board is actually substantially more charged than the remote is they should have put a bigger battery in this mark's going to try and change the battery out in his remote for something beefier all the time i have for fun today i've got to say milton Keynes is kind of like the city of the future and i'm not even talking about all the electric skateboarders riding around the place you've got those food delivery drones which almost had one of us off because it just sort of was appeared at a junction but they seem pretty good i did love it when it said uh <laughs> excuse me brilliant mark was very taken with his brand new bamboo gtx still got the carbon gt there is definitely quite a difference between the bamboo gtx and the carbon gt it's all in the flex and the feel you know if you want to be serious and fast and majorly off-road then you're going to be better off with the carbon gt but if you just want to relax into the cruise and have a good time, then my recommendation would be the Bamboo GTX. And although Milton Keynes might be the city of the future, so to speak, from a robots delivering food and footpaths everywhere and a grid of dual carriageways connected by roundabouts, so it's really quick and easy to get everywhere. And I've just noticed someone else has come back. Hello, I forgot you had to come back as well. We could have just ridden together. I had a phone call, so I had to go straight back. It was a good fun ride, wasn't it? it was a I really enjoyed ride. it. I can see myself coming to Milton Keynes on a lot of weekends over this summer. Milton Keynes is great. Isn't it? It is great. It's like a ginormous skate park. It's yeah, everywhere you can go. Skateboard. Yeah, and for the most part, you're not by the side of a road or anything. Excellent. I'll see you Tuesday. Yeah, have fun. Bye. Milton Keynes is fantastic. It does feel a bit soulless though, because part of the problem with having the houses all away from the roads, so roads can't see houses and houses can't see roads, but consequently, you get no feel for where you are, and the whole place is just a great big grid. The Americans amongst us all know what I'm talking about. Anyway, time to get cracking. <laughs> Definitely Mother's Day family time. Just plug the car in quickly. Hello, happy Mother's Day again. How's it going? Yeah, I'm good time. Yeah, it was fantastic. Really enjoyed it actually. We were a great bunch. It's, it was quite a sort of. Can I have a banana? There were seven Teslas with, I think, in total oh, yeah, nine electric skateboards. Oh, oh the average age for that. The oldest, I think, was 55. There were a couple, of, couple in the 50s, a few in the 40s, few in the 30s. And I, so it was basically between 30 and, and 50 no, plus. No, no, no. Surely they're all about 15, really. They're just. Yes, yeah, yeah. mental age 15, absolutely. <laughs> it's brilliant. It's, it's really good fun. And Milton Keynes is the perfect place for it because, of course, it's just cycle paths everywhere. You can virtually go from one side of the place to the other with barely seeing a road. It's incredible. We went all the way into the centre and went into the Tesla store and, and like... With your pulled, electric Yeah, we're not, not on them. We sort of dragged them in and sort of stuck them under the stairs at the back and then stood around chatting. And God only knows what the Tesla salespeople were thinking. <laughs> and had to come back to be sociable with wonderful family people. Quite right. Hello. Mark, Hello. Mark, I'm Is that Lego? 
Yeah. Yeah, he's into his Lego. Yeah, what is it? What do you call it? A Minecraft. A Minecraft thing, is it? What it is, it's a retro 1960s race car. Yeah. That's what it is. But modern. It goes like one. What year is it? Uh, 2012. So it's, it's a modern built race car from the 60s. Nice. It's got character. Yeah. That's what we like about these things. I still think they need a big battery though. <laughs> well, yeah, imagine, but you could, that, yeah, imagine that you could have so much. Yeah, room. loads of room for a yeah, battery right, right here. Yeah. You know, great weight distribution. Even so, I plug it in. Yes. <laughs> I do. Right. I love the filler cap. Yeah, nice. oh, you, yeah. you could stick a Chadmo on the other side of that, yeah. couldn't you? It's a nice car. It I do is. like it. It keeps you young, you know. That's basically his electric skateboard, yeah. and just like an electric skateboard. Keeps you and young. a vlogging camera, it, it does keep you young, it also doesn't work in the wet. Yes. Yeah. Let's go in and have coffee. We've obviously left my parents now. Sophie's just doing a quick bit of emergency shopping. We need milk for coffees. Then we're off home, which hopefully is going to be a really boring but short journey. Then I've got to have a two kilometre run. Why am I telling everybody my to do list? In terms of these, I think they're called Garden Cities, Milton Keynes, for example, or Harlow, I think that's another one. Apparently the government wants to make a bunch more of them, somewhere between the M1 and the M11. So, uh, <laughs> but you know what, I mean, they're kind of a bit soulless, but they're also very functional. I hope you've enjoyed today's vlog post. If you have, remember to like it, share it and subscribe if you haven't already. As Jasper says, Bye bye YouTube kids, and follow me on Twitter and Instagram if you don't already, and I'll see you tomorrow for the next instalment of my daily vlog. Bye. How's Jazzy B? Is he good? Yes. Fantastic. Went for a very slow walk. Oh, why slow? Just because he had to keep digging holes for rabbits. What, to help the rabbits? Or yes. to find rabbits? No, to help the rabbits digging rabbits. Oh, that was nice of him. Yes, Jasper. I found the cute little one.